Protesters have stormed the United Nations office in Abuja, accusing Iranian government of sponsoring the Islamic movement in Algeria with the aim of carrying out terror activities in Algeria. The group of protesters is therefore calling on the UN to sanction Iran and El Zaki for alleged terrorism. Our correspondent Basilo Kafo has details in this report. An anti-terrorism coalition operating under the aegis of Agenda for Terrorism Free Nigeria has staged a peaceful protest at the United Nations office in Abuja, calling on the organization to sanction Iran and El Zazaki for terrorism. Officials of the group allege that they got a reliable information that the El Zazaki-led group was getting support from Islamic Republic of Iran to carry out terrorism across Nigeria. We cannot in any way afford our nation to be destroyed by some set of people in our dear nation Nigeria. The Islamic movement of Nigeria, we are, we are telling them and their sponsors that enough is enough. The group also condemned the recent protests the Islamic movement in Nigeria stage at the National Assembly complex where the members allegedly forced their way into the complex to demand the release of their leader, Ibrahim Zazaki. This invasion is an effort on the right of other, other Nigerians who have no desire to see their parliament overthrow by, by fanatics. I, my job is to pass this on to the management. I'm doing this on behalf of the United Nations resident coordinator and I will pass on your petition to him. I want to thank you also for doing this in a very peaceful manner. Uh, that is how it is done in civilized society. So. The anti-terrorism coalition has threatened to prevail on Nigerian government to activate Article 18 of the UN Charter, which states that freedom to manifest one religion or belief may be subject only to such limitations as are prescribed by law and are necessary to protect public safety, the fundamental rights and freedoms of others. Basil Okafo, Court TV News, Abuja. Thank you.